And Gabe, you know, a lot of people thought you were in line. Well, you were in the run for the Canelo fight. Um, he ended up fighting Amir Khan. Yeah. Uh, just how surprised were you, man? What do you think about the fight? I wasn't even disappointed that I didn't get that I didn't get the fight because it was it was a situation where I was putting it in God's hands where it was like you know I'm not gonna force the issue. Um, if it happens, it happens, and I'll and I'll get ready. If not, then you know the opportunity of presenting itself you know later down the road. But um, you know I was surprised because you know Khan's a smaller fighter, but at the end of the day I really think that it's a risky fight for Canelo because it's it's a fight where he has nothing to gain but everything to lose. You know what I mean. Stylistically, how do you see it? Or, I mean, is, is the weight going to play an issue at all, Gabe? Because a lot of people, the concern, they're not giving Khan a chance because of the weight and, and the size. Of course, of course the weight's going to play an issue, without a doubt. But, you know, it's up to Khan and the condition that he brings to, he has to be on his toes and he has to be boxing. He can't engage with Canelo and try to go toe to toe with Canelo. He has to stay disciplined with a jab and, and constantly moving. Do you think that. It, if Canelo wins, do you think he fights Triple G this year, Gabe? That's, that, they said that's the plan. They say it's in writing. Do you think it happens? Who knows? <laughs> like, who, who saw Khan happening, right? No one saw that happening. So you really can't say, man. So it's just one of those things where, you know, you would think so, but it's boxing, man. Anything can happen in boxing.